even when you film it. Even when it's on film. It could be turned off. Even when it's illegal. Even when it's illegal. Even <laughs> when the chief of police said that the chokehold is against NYPD policy. In now they're calling it. Years. In 20 years. They're calling it now a seatbelt choke. Oh. That's what they said on the news. It was a blood choke, not an airway choke. He's you know. Dead. Semantics. Fox News said that this is an issue about taxes. That's the deep core issue because NYPD has to protect the tax revenue of the city. Why didn't they just write him a ticket? Where was the cigarette though? Where was the cigarette though? Thank you all for being out here. I'm gonna hand this off now. Hands up! Do if you will allow it. Um, last words, last words before we move forward. Last words. My name, my name is Bella, and I'm from Oakland, California. I just got back. I just got back from Ferguson. I've been live streaming all the events out there, and I want to say from everybody out there and the people who are watching my live stream right now, thank you for not ignoring this problem. I want you to know that while we are out here, you need to realize that they want us to stay silent. The reason why, especially in a city like Las Vegas, that pulls so much revenue, that they want to keep it silent, that there is an activist community here who is conscious and wants to do something about it. You see that all of these places out here weren't even playing their music that loud, but as we started making a point, they wanted to drown us out because they want to keep our voices unheard. When we are out here and we say black lives matter, I want you to know that we do not mean all lives don't matter. Amen. But as black victims, we are the only ones who have to constantly define our humanity to prove to you that it exists even after we are dead. They tell us that we shouldn't break windows because we are not filled with righteous indignation, that this is not a black or a white thing, but they oftentimes catch the white victims, whether they shoot up movie theaters or schools or bomb buildings. <laughs> Our unarmed children are being shot. Children. If they're seven-year-olds and sleep in the bed, if they're 12-year-olds and playing with a, a toy in the park, or if they're, if they're uh, inspecting an item in a store before they buy it as a consumer, which we are a consumer nation in an open carry state, you will be shot and killed because your skin color means you are a criminal. We need to know our power and stand together. <laughs> we can't do it alone though. We do need people to shed that willful ignorance. We need people to come outside of their bubble and stand with us. Because if you don't stand with us, what you have seen with this country as capitalism on steroids, you will be the next one. But if they successfully eradicate us all, we will not be here to stand with you the same way we did with women's right to vote, with LGBTQ rights or anything else. So before they get rid of us, stand with us. No peace, no justice, 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 no
have Bella for president if I believe in electoral politics. Fuck that shit. I throw my body on the gears. The only way change is affected, the way these reformists get the ground to make change is because we are out here on the streets. I talk to my live shit. <laughs> I'm talking to like 300 people right now. I'm like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm like, me too, because it's my baby. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, will you send me a copy? Thank you. All right, baby. We marching, baby. I don't think anybody is going to break anything, but I made a point because when they talk about store windows or buildings, I don't give a fuck about that window and that building. Eric Garner can't come back to life, but a window got insurance so they can rebuild that window. Nobody is bleeding. Nobody mother is crying because their son won't come home because the Starbucks window is missing. So I don't like to hear that bullshit. Sorry. You leaving? Not even my mama. I'm oh. Leave it. I got it. Thank you so much. <laughs> Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Say see you on the live stream. Thank you. Thank you. I'm right here. You want this? He's like, I want to get out the stroller. We're walking the wrong way down the one way on 4th Street. And I don't know what this is yet. Um, when we come up to it, I'll give you the cross, the cross street. Well, I mean, I would think that the cold would tell me where to go in, but it's Vegas. I forget it stays warm out here. It's only 9.30. He just want to get out the stroller. If they was rallying for a long time in one spot, I would let him out and play. So we just passed Carson and 4th. We're walking up 4th. Uh, it's a one way going down, so. I know, baby, you can get out the stroller in a minute. I promise. He like, I went from the car seat to the stroller, mama. When I'm gonna stop being strapped in? We do have disabled people in the crowd, so the police need to keep their shit together tonight. There are children in the crowd, including my sweet, young, beautiful baby. It kills me as he wears a hoodie tonight when he's gonna be old enough, old enough for them to say that he's a threat, when I'm not gonna be able to let him go outside because he wanna get a Twizzler or some shit from the corner store. Do I really think I should be cursing in front of my child? Why don't you talk to the cable networks about that cartoon Uncle Grandpa before you get to talking to me, to me about cursing? But secondarily, everything that's been happening concerning the shooting and the murder of black men is far more offensive and egregious than anything that could possibly come out of my mouth. So as a college educated woman and a professional public speaker, I can oftentimes not find the proper words in Japanese, Tongan, or English, except for fuck, this shit is fucked up. And if you don't like it, there's always a mute button on your computer. No peace! 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 No peace!
No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! No peace! I march a lot. Now! Justice! Now! Justice! Now! Justice! Last week! Last week! Hey, can somebody get banned? Uh, Joe Whitey up out of there? That's right. Don't shoot. That's right, baby. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. That's right, baby. Tell them how you feel. Say, I am not a threat. That's right, baby. That's right, mama's baby. He obviously gonna be a child of the revolution. <laughs> Did I give you a card? No, you have it. Here you go. Thank you so much. Thank you. No problem. Oh, we got the ghetto bird out, y'all. This is such a wonderful waste of your tax dollars. People are peaceably assembling, marching down the street. Oh my God, we need a helicopter. Doesn't the helicopter cost something like $500 in gas to gas up every time? It's like 15 minutes for $500. Man, you know what? One vibe I definitely don't get from this crowd. There's not a black block vibe. There's not a strong anarchist vibe. There's not a nihilist vibe. What the fuck is this? Y'all been watching too much TV. They're peaceful as shit. Honey, there have been children at every single protest I've been to. That never stops the tear gas, the kettling, or none of that shit. Oh no, here. Well, I'm a live streamer for Occupy and Ferguson, and I'll be there next week, and I just got back. So, yes, no, I'm telling you. Yeah, on Twitter, they were tweeting while getting tear gas. Yeah, like, yeah, because what else are we going to do? CNN ain't going to tell shit. They're going to be like, oh, my God, the protesters threw a water bottle. I'm like, well, finish that. First, you snatched up somebody hella violently, and then they... Right, right, I'm like, and then they threw a water bottle that bounced harmlessly off your riot gear in Kevlar. Ooh, I'm sorry. Fuck you. Fucking shit. We're at the back of the march. I got the baby. Otherwise, y'all know I'd be all up and through this thing and in the front and everything. Not me! Not him! Not her! No, like, I'm loud than a motherfucker. <laughs> I should just start a chant from back here. Huh? 
<laughs> Hold on, y'all. I got to push and stream. I'm multitasking. Convict! Send that killer cop to jail! The whole damn system is guilty as hell! Indict! Convict! Send that killer cop to jail! The whole damn system is guilty as hell! You know that's your mama. <laughs> Convict! Send that killer cop to jail! The whole damn system is guilty as hell! Indict, convict, send that killer cop to jail. Hold him. We're on 4th and Garces. I don't know where the fuck that's at. Y'all know I ain't from here, but we on 4th and Garces, so y'all know. Group of we have a group of us. We have a group of us. Who I've been speaking about taking this to the strip. So my question is, do we want to... How far are you? How far are you? Wait, how far is that? I got a little umbrella stroller. I don't know. That's where we're going to far. It's fine. I mean, my car is parked downtown, too, so I'm walking in. You know I'm walking in. Man, no, you disrupt the system. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. They're trying to walk these trips. Oh, yeah, y'all shouldn't have stopped and said shit. You should have just kept going. We was good. We had good momentum. We had a good momentum. <laughs> do that for so long. I can't long term it though. How about uh, united we stand, divided we fall. An injury to one is an injury to all. Ain't no power like the power to people because the power to people don't stop. Oh look at the cops are filming us. Oh hey now. The same way your cameras is watching us, I'm watching you. You think I'm easy to control, you ain't got a clue. Revolution's on the way, let's see what you gonna do. You gonna send... Well, they're taking pictures of all the protesters' faces. They're taking pictures of the protesters' faces, which we should never, ever be surprised about. Far. Is that the strip right there with the stratosphere? stratosphere? Yeah. I don't know, but at some point I'm turning around because I got my baby. I can't walk all the in this. Denny's? You want your bottle, baby? Yay! Siete ocho. I don't understand why we're counting in Spanish. I'm gonna ask somebody about that. Somebody tell me what this is about, the counting. 
the counting. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay. They're counting for the 43 missing students in uh in Ayosapa. I'm sorry. We're headed to Las Vegas Boulevard. You know I'm not from here, but apparently that means some big shit. I don't think Vegas police are going to let them take the strip because they rushing up. <laughs> hey, can somebody post in the chat? Is the chat working?